Hi, my name is Lily Fermato. I'm a female 20 year old art gallery owner from Withville, Virginia. I'm an, primarily an oil painter. My art teacher said that she created a monster when she introduced me to oil paint. So that's my main medium that I use, but I also dabble in spray paint, ink, oil pastels, basically anything. Um, I'm not shy to try new things. I would just consider myself a expressionist artist. I paint um, vibrant colors on canvas, usually women, and then a lot of landscapes with palette knife. My dad is an artist, my grandmother is an artist, basically like my whole dad's side of the family are artists, and I used to paint with my dad all the time when I was little. And we would sit in front of the TV and watch SNL, and I would be, you know, painting with him. I like to paint femininity, I love to paint, you know, the female body, the form, the condition of women. The women I paint, I guess, are me. I figured that out, they're all me, even if they don't look like me. Um, and it's usually very positive, or it's sometimes heartbreaking. I paint a lot of nudes that are just about the female condition and what it represents, and a lot of it is beauty and love and rebirth and fertility and then other parts of my painting are almost seeping into the society in which we live in so sometimes my women can feel like they're over sexualized when they're not they're just being themselves and that's how i feel sometimes like i feel like i'm always over sexualized and I, I live in the bible belt in southwestern virginia so i get a lot of that i opened my art gallery when i was 18 years old and it's been doing well for over two years now. And opening this art gallery in December of 2018 is basically a, a blur to me. My hometown never had any really art scene here. So I wanted to represent all different types of art, modern art, traditional art, just for everyone, and kind of make this a space where people could be themselves. I hosted three drag shows here, um, obviously before COVID, um, but it was, it's probably one of my greatest accomplishments is to actually, you know, include an LGBTQIA community here. So my studio is basically a community as well. I have different artists come in here and paint with me. I'm from Appalachia. I live in the Bible Belt. And I'm a young art gallery owner that has nudes in, their, in my gallery. And I paint a lot of what that feels like to me. I try not to hold myself to the bounds of a certain aesthetic or anything really like that. I just paint how I feel. And sometimes I feel like looking back on my childhood and sometimes I feel sad and depressed and sometimes I feel extremely happy and I paint that. My theme is everything, my, the theme is me. And I think people should take away from that. It's so different, but that's okay. One, two, three.